Right, open up your next in editor. I'll wait for that boot up. Right, once the uh, next in editor is open, uh, you'll be confronted by this screen. Obviously I've got some already open, but we'll forget about that. What you needed to be doing is going up to file. So you go to file. You want to be opening up your HML file. So wherever you put your HML, HMI file, eh, mine are in my folder. So we'll click this one, 2.4 inch uh, unique UK flag one. So we go and open it. And you get the screen come up with the uh, all the images on. These are all your screen images, and these are your folders up on this side with all the different. It's your DMR screen. That's your main idle screen. But won't worry about that. Right. To make a TFT file, you want to be interested in this button here. So you've loaded in your HMI file. You want to click on compile, and you'll notice down here it'll say compile successful, no errors. Right, this is the fiddly bit, and this is a right weird way of doing it. You need to then go to back up to file, and you want to be going into this folder here, open build folder, and there is your TFT file. And you drag and drop that onto your desktop or into my documents uh, to, um, oh, sorry, it's already got one in there. Um, so that's, that's in your my documents there. So that's all you do is you go to that compile, Press the compile button, back up to file, open up build folder, and your TFT file will be in there. I've just moved it to the uh, documents folder, but that's how you uh, that's how you create a TFT file from a HMI file. Very simple, guys. Hope that helps.